Please adhere to YouTube's selected guidelines before viewing content of this video. I do not encourage or condone any products, actions, or behaviors shown in this video. All videos are produced in a safe, professional, and controlled environment. Please do not attempt to replicate any actions performed during the video. All actions are performed by professionals. All right. Love you. Love you too. Bye. Alrighty, so today I'm going to Japan. It's my first time ever going to Japan, and I'm very excited to go to Japan, I will admit. It's currently 4.32 in the morning. I woke up about an hour and a half ago, and I'm feeling pretty chipper, which is not the usual. I'm gonna be spending the next 18 hours on a plane slash in an airport, uh, which I am not the most excited about, I will admit. Uh, but I am very, very, very excited to, well, have the opportunity to go to Japan, that is for sure. Oh, whoa, what's up, what's up? How's it going, how's it going? How are y'all doing this morning? Just got my intro going. My dad literally just dropped me off. Can't complain. Smoke-free facility, the hell? See, I think I'm gonna try to get tickets at terminals instead of talking to somebody, I hope. I'm not sure. I printed mine off last night, but I don't know if that's the actual boarding pass or not. This is all Frontier, I guess. So Air Canada is down here, yeah. Big bet. I'm gonna try to. Booking reference, e-ticket, frequent flyer, employee ID. Scan. Passport, boarding pass, itinerary seat. Scan. Oh, oh. Let's not put this on video. <laughs> I've got to scan this. So where do I scan this? Hi, sir. How are you? Good. How are you? Scan. I'm gonna keep my passport in my back pocket because I know they're gonna want a TSA. All right. Print. Select. Printing failed. All right. See, I wouldn't let me do mine because of the back stuff. Huh? Your passport? Oh no, for the VAC stuff. So, cause it wouldn't let me print even the one for here. So I'm just gonna get in line. So let's see, that's bag drop. There's priority check-in, kind of be close. How's it going? Cool. I'm just, uh, I'm going to Japan and it says I need the VAC stuff. I've got my COVID test and everything. Sounds good. So here's my passport, and then I'll just get my COVID documents out real quick. Are you together? Um, yes, but we have like different. Okay, all right, so let's, I'll take this. Yeah. You said that one letter. Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, yeah.
try to stay organized. <laughs> I always agree. Thank you very much. And then did you have any bags you like to check in at all? Nah. Thank you very much. I do appreciate it. Thank you very much. Have a great rest of your day. And there we go, y'all. All checked in. I don't know if y'all can see me, but it is what it is. I'm saying. Oh, oh. Easy enough process. Indeed. Indeed. Especially since it's, I don't know, like 4.30 in the morning. Right, yeah. <laughs> Makes it Not so much easier. Uh, Not enough, yeah. yeah, enough of a line. Of a line yeah, seriously. Right. Go and turn up my... Uh, TSA line. Wait, it was, it was 0 to 15 minutes when I took the first. Well, we've got plenty of time anyway, right. so... Is what we plan for. It still says zero fifteen, so it's probably moving pretty quick. It looks like there's a lot of different queues, so that's good. Yeah, I'm sure one of them is like the priority one or something like that kind of thing as well. <sighs> How much was the flight again? It was like eleven hundred bucks. Yeah, eleven seventy-three, I think. Eleven seventy-three, y'all. That's how much the flight was. This is the cheapest flight I could get to Japan as well. So yeah, taking the cheapest flight to Japan today, still eleven seventy-five. Expensive. But that's both ways. It's not one way. So it's actually like what? What is that? Six hundred bucks? It's actually not that bad for going literally around the entire world. Uh, so <laughs> well, not around the entire world, halfway around the world, I guess. This is not terrible. Seriously, crazy shit. Not looking forward to spending the next 18 hours in, in either an airport or a <laughs> or a plane, that's for damn sure. And then doing it again on the way back. I was afraid that uh, getting up this morning was gonna be too big of a deal, but I, I had a, a big brain move. I chugged water right before bed, so I had to, so, and then I, I, exactly, and then I ended up having to go to the bathroom exactly when my first <laughs> alarm went off. It worked out perfectly. I usually suck at waking up in the morning. I'm up at like 10 o'clock every, I'm up at like 10 o'clock every day if I, uh, if I go to bed at like, one I, not a light sleeper i go to sleep and i sleep heavy kicks my ass it's a little signal arm i don't know my body so it's just like waking me up right before it goes on this happened this morning that's the up best like two or three minutes before my alarm went off oh that's like, sweet hmm. okay <laughs> that's what i'm talking about can't complain about that so that's priority check-in that's not us known crew members and airport employees i don't think that's us no That's TSA pre, so I don't think that's even us. That's sweet. Exactly. Like, okay. <laughs> we believe you, you know. Give me two hundred dollars, I believe you. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, I can't complain about that. <laughs> Gotta love TSA. <laughs> Oh, 
I forgot to put everything in my pockets in the uh, in my backpack. Now I'm gonna have to take them all out. Oh well. I think they were supposed to put that in your check bag. Oh, no. No, seriously. Lines are crazy. go with this one. Oh, sweet, they gave us both tickets too. Different than the last time I came through, I had to take my laptop out last time.
I know what your middle name is now. Whoa. Made it through. Made it through. What flagged in your bag? Huh? What flagged in your, in your bag? Oh, nothing. Oh, it didn't? Yeah. It, it just took me a minute because I had to put my belt on. It flagged Brandon's, though. Yeah. yeah. Pull all everything out and like have like your bags all laid out flat. That was really nice. That's good because that's how it was last time, and it was such a pain because then I have to put my backpack back in right. and I everything. Have my stuff set up so that I could just like shove everything in really quick and just take it out and put it back yeah. in. Yeah. She was like, make sure not to leave anything out. I was like, oh, seriously? Okay. Yeah. That's a new one. How's it going? How's it going? I figure you might want this. It was in my bin for some reason. I don't know why, but it was. Yeah. Sure I have mine now. <laughs> I'm gonna do do the same. Bet. And uh, I think they changed the gate. It's now at C9. No. Damn, we made it through in good time though. Whoa. So now we've got like two hours to hang out. <laughs> hey, doesn't hurt to get to the airport on time. TSA line was a lot shorter than I thought it was going to be. No, seriously. No. Oh, wait. Oh, this is Toronto and Tokyo. You guys already have your other ones too? Yeah. That's scary. All right. I got it, I guess. You trust me a lot more than I trust me. Makes sense. Hey, big bet, big bet. And we're at gate some C something, so. Like C9. Yeah. There's another flight there now, but might as well just go hang out around there. Duty free? How many cigarettes can I buy? Everybody wants. I want 42nd Street Oyster Bar. That's what I want right now. <laughs> really, really, really expensive food <laughs> at the airport. I'm just bummed they don't have a Chick fil A here. Because Chick fil A usually opens like 6 o'clock, so I'd be able to get Chick fil A an hour before the flight. That would be clean. Uh, Charlotte. I'm surprised they don't sell hella nicotine gum here. They'd make bank if they did. That's not us. Dallas Fort Worth. It's an easy flight. It's a flight I took last time, actually on American too. Yeah. Yeah. Do we just want to hang out at one of the Oh okay. Yeah. Find an open seat and chill out for the next two hours. Oh. Sweet, sweet. Oh.
I'd figure as much. I ain't got no Chick-fil-A in Toronto though. I was bummed. my backpack just so I don't have to uh, stress about losing anything or anything like that. Our customers in group 5 will continue boarding by 2605 in Dallas. Yeah, right, pretty much. Now, if I go to sleep now, I'm not waking back up. That's not happening. I'll sleep when we got the 13-hour flight. for the last 30 minutes. I'm trying to think if there's anything I figured I, if I forgot to mention. I mentioned how much the flight cost. I mentioned how long it's gonna take because it's gonna be about 18 hours with flights and just airports in general. So I'm gonna be going 18 hours without smoking. It's gonna be fun, but I was smart. Oh, that's what I forgot to mention. But I was smart because we I brought some vouchers. Group number six to board our flight to Dallas. If you're not already an advantage member, you can join for free by going to aa.com slash enroll. But, but I brought some nicotine pouches and some nicotine gum. So I should be all good to go. I also have an insane amount of snacks on me. So I should be, I did indeed. <laughs> of course, I ain't going a day without. It was, my, it was my last smoke in America. I was actually thinking that when I was walking because I was just walking around the neighborhood and I was just like, man, last smoke here and I feel like the next five weeks. Oh, that's one other thing I forgot to mention. Gonna be gone for like the next five weeks. I'm hype. Gonna be with you guys for the next two weeks. And then I'm gonna be solo traveling for the next three after that. Which I'm a little bit nervous for, I will admit. But I am very, very, very excited for nonetheless, that is for sure. I think that's all about, just about all I had to say. I think that's 30 minutes in the video and I finally got the intro done. <laughs> I was running through my head last night as I was trying to go to sleep, thinking about what I needed to say. So I, was like, I think that's everything. I think I covered the bases. Yeah, when y'all texted that y'all were on the way, we were already like halfway here, and then <laughs> y'all are still like, what, like 30 seconds after I got here? Yeah, just so much more proof that y'all live closer. <laughs> I, I've heard stories. I've heard stories. You gotta do what you gotta do, right? Let's see, where's the. Uh... I'm gonna put my backpack over here and I'm gonna go home. Fill up my water bottle. Of course, I'm not paying for I'm not paying for damn airport water. Shit's like fucking four dollars. Not fucking happening. Oh, they even got a bottle thing. Oh, that's sweet. That's nice. I gotta take gotta take the cap off first though. Got it all over my hand. That's okay, though. Oh, sweet. Oh, and it knew when to stop. That's nice. That's nice. Love these things. 34,000. That's eh, not super high, but it's pretty good. Alrighty, though, y'all. I've got about two hours until the flight leaves. I don't really think I have anything else to say. So I think I am going to go ahead and just turn off recording just for the moment. 
just for the sake of not using up the entire space in my phone in one go. And um, yeah, I'll see y'all in two hours once the flight is about to board. So uh, yeah, hope y'all have fun until then. It's gonna be like five seconds for y'all, but two hours for me. Enjoy y'all. I guess we'll find out if it's the wrong gate when, uh, when the plane leaves. <laughs> Still got like 20 minutes. And I didn't get a notification or anything because I signed up for text. I signed it up for I signed up for text reminders on whether it changed. Yeah. Alrighty, so it's been about an hour and a half now. And I ain't gonna lie, it's been now about no, it hasn't been an hour and a half. It's been about an hour since I last talked to y'all, that's what it was. But it's been an hour and a half since I last had a cigarette. And I ain't gonna lie, I be wanting some nicotine right now. But I had the forethought to not only bring some extra cigarettes, but to also bring some nicotine gum and to also bring some snus. So I'm gonna go ahead and get my snus out real quick. Out of my backpack, I have it somewhere in here. Let's see, there we go, got my snus. Just go ahead and uh, put all that back in there. And uh, I think I'm gonna go ahead and uh, open this up and grab myself a little bit of a pouch in all honesty, because uh, I'll be wanting some. Let's just go ahead, adjust that just a little bit. There we go. Just gonna get this all opened up, if I can. This is always a pain, these are always a pain to open up for me. Uh, Alright y'all, this is really hard to open. This is really hard to open. Now I was looking at the flight stuff last night as well, and they still had like lots of open seats too. I was like, what? Like I could choose any, I could choose like a lot of different seats. I was like, what is going on? This is so not normal. Oh, there we go. Oh no, I closed it again by accident. Okay, this is being a pain. I'm really struggling right now, y'all. struggling so much right now oh there we go i got it open y'all i got it open looking forward to uh looking forward to having a pouch need my nicotine this nest i've got today is some uh camel frost I know it's not the best snus in the world. It's certainly not some of the good snus I've heard of before, but it's what they sell at gas stations in my local area, so it's what I buy. But hopefully, in the next couple minutes or so, it starts giving me some nicotine and everything like that kind of thing. I think I might go fill up my water bottle before the flight. I think we've got 20 minutes, 20 minutes until boarding. Yeah, just about 15 minutes until boarding now uh, for the flight. Took me a total of 10 minutes to go ahead and get that can tin of snus all opened up. But I think I'm gonna go fill up my water bottle, probably go take a piss. And I think that is overall the plan. I think that's overall the plan. So um, yeah, not really too much else to say. The flight to Toronto is about an hour and a half and then we've got a four hour layover. And then we get on the plane to Japan, the plane to Japan. And that is like a 12 hour and 30 minute flight if not like 13 hours kind of thing, probably more like 13 hours in all honesty. It's gonna be uh, an experience that is for sure. It's the longest flight I've ever taken and uh, I am both looking forward to it and not looking forward to it at the same time, I will admit. But uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna go fill up my water bottle in a minute and I think I'm gonna go take a piss at the same time. 
Big bet, big bet. I'm gonna go and address my phone. All right. Uh. Y'all mind looking after my backpack for a minute? Hey, big bet, big bet. Oh, no? Oh, okay. Well, oh, you know, never mind then. <laughs> no, I don't mind. So. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> it's strange how both of those answers are acceptable in other people. Right. Yeah, not forgetting nothing. Big bet, I'll be back. Less than one second. But yeah, no. I'm just going to go and fill up my water bottle once again just before the flight, just so I don't have to wait until in flight water comes out to get. Uh, anything to actually drink because I know if I have snus in my mouth it's not gonna be a fun time I gotta have water while I'm while I while I'm using my snus and uh, I'm also gonna go ahead and take a piss and thankfully the men's room is on this side but I'm not recording I'm not recording in the bathroom that's not happening I'm turning it off before record before I walk in the bathroom and I'm turning it back on right after I come back out and there we go oh. come on come on come on come on you can do this okay there we go. Put that down. Just down for a moment. There we go. It's all on. I'll see y'all in just a minute because uh, I'm going to go take a piss real quick, y'all. Alrighty, so just got out of the bathroom. I ain't gonna lie, it was a pretty nice bathroom. Some of the sinks didn't work, don't get me wrong, but the amount of paper towels they gave was just about the most paper towels I've ever seen. It just kept going and going and going, and it was one of the electric ones, and I was just like, am I just gonna get the entire roll of paper towels? That's what it felt like, that's what it felt like, and honestly, I felt like a king in there. I was getting all the paper towels, and I really can't complain about that, that is for sure, but now I've got about, put water bottle back in my backpack. How's it going? How's it going? Hell yeah, I'm glad to hear. I'm glad to hear. Filled up my water bottle. Yes, sir. So I don't have to wait for that in-flight water. Yeah, this would be a good time to check my shoes. I'm on the plane. They put it on the wrong flight by accident, but it's okay. That's not Oh, did y'all put air tags in your bags? Yeah. Smart move. But um, we've got ooh, about seven minutes till the flight is supposed to board. It's 6.23 right now. The flight is supposed to board at 6.30. It's supposed to take off at 7.30. I think I'm going to get my... I have a second phone that I downloaded like 30 hours worth of video onto. I'm going to get that out in a minute. And I think... What else was I going to do? I think I was just gonna get my second phone out and I think that was it. It's only an hour and a half flight, but I'm probably just gonna watch TV on it. And I think that's pretty much the plan if I had to guess. And um, yeah, no, looking forward to it. Looking forward to getting to Canada. It'll be my first time in Canada. And I wanna say, oof, three years, I wanna say, three years. Haven't been to Canada in, in a while, but it's a nice country. Granted, I'm only gonna be spending time in the airport, but still looking forward to it. I'm gonna see like seven Tim Hortons in the airport. So, looking forward to it, that is for sure. But um, yeah, gonna be boarding in just the next couple minutes and I think I'm just gonna go ahead and get everything ready to board and I'll see y'all well, when I'm boarding the plane, you know what I'm saying? I'm saying. We were indeed. It is now what? 637? Yeah.
we do ask before you get to the desk that you already have your passport out to the picture frame, your boarding pass in hand. We are going to go ahead and start with zone one. And there we go. It's time to board, y'all. What zone? What zone am I in? Let's see if I can find out. I am in zone. Wrong, wrong boarding pass. Priority boarding with zone two, zones one and two. Zone three, bet. Zone three, yes, sir. There we go, y'all. It's time to board. Got all my backpack stuff all zipped up and bet. Yeah. Big fucking bet. Thank you. I'm hype. No, we're gonna board anybody with young children that might need any extra time or assistance going down the jet bridge. <laughs> I was about to make that joke. <laughs> Big bat, big bat. All right, we're going to continue with zone three, zones one, two, and three. Big bat. <laughs> Have a good one. I'm in. I don't know. I should probably look. Seat 21A. Yeah. She's trying to get me caught up. She lied. <laughs> so they're all zone four? Oh, yeah, because they're not sitting on the inside, are they? Uh, no. See so you in row 21? Yes, sir. So I'm just on the exact opposite side of you, essentially. Yeah. Nice. Honestly. How's it going? Can't complain? Thank you very much. Have a great one. You ready? Uh, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. It is, Joe. It's almost like it's 44 degrees outside right now. Man, they did heat the hallway, though. I ain't gonna lie. So let's see. Let's so remember my uh, seat place 21A. 21A. Very, very, very nice. Oh, Air Canada, wow. I'm gonna have to duck down for this door. Oh, it's tight. Coming in with
it's like all the way back, I suppose. That's a nice box. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's a nice box. A little bit smaller than normal. We do ask for passengers. If you're having any issues with your bag, just use the space under the seat in front of you to store your bag. On the other side, and if the passengers stand behind you, take the seat. We'll be one to assist you once the house has been cleared. It has been simple, but it's been a lot of art on the door. The cover is very pretty, but it's not normal. So, for you, Madame, if you want to use the space, you can use the space for you. For you, you can use the space. Which one's A? Um, this side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In that. Honestly, because I think I can store it under here and call in need space. my bag because my backpack will fit under the seat right here. I don't know if there's anybody sitting here. There wasn't anybody sitting in these seats last night. Yeah. A perfect fit. 
That's what I'm talking about. For your safety and comfort, please stow carry-on items identified with a white tag under the seat in front of you. Other carry-on baggage may be placed in the overhead bins. Your portable electronic devices should be set to airplane mode until an announcement is made upon arrival. If you need assistance or have any concerns, please let one of us know. not a bad one but it's an experience nonetheless I'm hoping to not get motion sick this time we'll take it off that's the hope you got motion sick while taking off yeah i do a little bit that's why i like sitting next to the window helps so much wait i'm hoping not to get motion sick that's for sure honestly i'm gonna be having to hold my phone like this and get that uh get that sunrise time lapse Watch, I'm going to be on the wrong side. Welcome aboard a Canada Express flight 8835 with service to Toronto. My name is Nikki, your service director on this flight today to Toronto. And our flight time today shows that we'll be flying for one hour, seven minutes Ooh, uh, at a plan cruise and altitude of 39,000 feet. Gate to gate, time will be an hour, 35 minutes. What are conditions in Toronto? Particle is nice, the temperature of minus two degrees Celsius. As we are getting ready for our departure, ensure that your seatbelts are securely fastened, bags are to be safely stowed. Table trays and seat bags are to be brought to a bridal position. Any large electronic devices such as laptop computers are to be turned off and stowed. If you do have any questions or concerns, feel free to bring to the attention of one of us. And although wearing a face covering is no longer a Transport Canada requirement, it is still highly, it is still highly recommended that you could use one during our flight today. Thank you. Bon matin, mesdames et messieurs, bienvenue à la bonne auto, vos rythmes, Ritson, 25, à partir de bientôt à Toronto. Je m'appelle Nikki, je suis la directrice de service de vol ce matin vers Toronto. Notre durée de vol, vous avez 7 minutes de réserve, vous avez 25 minutes pour votre apport. Et notre rate de croisière sera 39 000 pieds. En préparation pour notre décollage, vous pourrez votre ceinture rangée, tout vos événements personnels ou de flux de siège devant vous. Merci pour votre apport. Top 
interprète ainsi que doute de votre siège pour les avaricales. Les petits après le territoire pour assurer mon avion jusqu'à l'annonce à ce sujet. Si vous avez une question ou une préoccupation, n'hésitez pas à adresser à l'un de nous. Et bien que le port de Cuba Visage ne soit pas une exigence de Transport Canada, il demeure fortement recommandé d'emporter un de notre vol aujourd'hui. Et un merci de participer aux membres à Réopan pour tous vos royautés avec vous. Merci. I got in my mouth is doing something is not doing enough I need to put another pouch in I swear but also my lip already be burning quite a bit so I don't really want another pouch but it is working better than not I do have my nicotine a little bit so I can't complain too much I do want some more nicotine though I, uh, I ain't smoking right now though sadly sadly Lorsque la consigne est éteinte. 
Rattachez votre ceinture, insérez les deux extrémités l'une dans l'autre et tirez la sangle pour l'ajuster autour de vos hanches. Chest into your lap. Grasp your ankles or wrap your arms under your legs. Or cross your arms across the seat back in front of you and press your head against your arms. En cas d'urgence, penchez-vous et appuyez votre poitrine et votre tête sur vos cuisses. Ensuite, saisissez vos chevilles ou passez vos bras sous vos jambes. Ou bien, croisez les bras contre le dossier du siège devant vous et appuyez votre tête contre vos bras. There are three exits located on each side of the aircraft. All of these are indicated by an exit sign. Please locate the one nearest you. Il y a trois issues de secours de chaque côté de l'avion. Chacune d'elles est indiquée par une enseigne de sortie. Veuillez repérer celle qui est la plus près de vous. If there is a need to evacuate the aircraft, leave your baggage behind and follow the floor lighting to the nearest emergency exit. S'il faut évacuer l'avion, laissez vos bagages à bord et suivez l'éclairage au plancher jusqu'à l'issue la plus proche. If the cabin pressure changes, an oxygen mask will drop from the panel above you. Remain seated. Pull the mask towards you. Adjust the support strap to hold the mask over your mouth and nose and breathe normally. Always secure your own mask before assisting another person. Si la pression de la cabine change, un masque à oxygène tombera du panneau au-dessus de vous. Restez assis. Tirez le masque vers vous. Utilisez la bande élastique pour maintenir le masque sur votre nez et votre bouche et respirez normalement. Mettez toujours votre masque avant d'aider quelqu'un. Seatbelt and no smoking signs are located throughout the aircraft. Please obey them at all times. Des consignes de ceinture et d'interdiction de fumée se trouvent à différents endroits dans l'avion. Veuillez les respecter en tout temps. Your portable electronic devices must be set to airplane mode until an announcement is made upon arrival. If your electronic device falls in your seat, do not move your seat or try to retrieve it yourself as it poses a fire hazard. Notify your cabin crew immediately to ensure the safe retrieval of the device. Les appareils électroniques portatifs doivent être réglés en mode avion jusqu'à l'annonce à ce sujet à l'arrivée. Si votre appareil électronique glisse dans votre siège, ne bougez pas votre siège et n'essayez pas de le récupérer à cause du risque d'incendie. Avertissez immédiatement le personnel de cabine afin qu'il le récupère en toute sécurité. In preparation for takeoff, please ensure your seatback and tray table are upright and your seatbelt is fastened. Aisles and exits need to be clear, and baggage, including purses and larger electronic devices, such as laptop computers, must be safely stowed. If you need any assistance or have any concerns, please let one of us know. Pour le décollage, veuillez redresser le dossier de votre siège, ranger votre tablette et attacher votre ceinture. Les couloirs et les sorties de secours doivent être dégagés, les bagages ainsi que les appareils électroniques portatifs de grand format, comme les ordinateurs portatifs, doivent être rangés de façon sécuritaire. Si vous avez une inquiétude ou besoin d'aide, adressez-vous à l'un de nous.
first leg of the journey, first leg of the 18 hours, about to be underway. And oh man, I am excited, I ain't gonna lie, I am excited. I guess uh, this guy over here probably needs to take off first, huh? I suppose so, probably. Very 
dark very quickly in here. I'm trying to conserve power for takeoff. Just like me turning off my AC and my 1999 camera. Understandable.
Oh, they're gone. All right, y'all. We are next in line. About to take off. And I'm hoping not to get motion sick. That's the hope. I'm pretty hyped, though. I'm pretty hyped. Let's see how this goes, you know what I'm saying? the window now we are in the clouds probably gonna go above the clouds in a couple minutes but right now I'm feeling pretty good can't complain doing pretty good taking off wasn't too bad landing is usually worse for me but uh no the g-forces are pretty good not a big roller coaster person but I will admit I do enjoy takeoffs and landings in planes if it's not super shaky we encourage you to wear your seat belts at all times. It is prohibited to smoke, to use electronic cigarettes, or to consume alcohol on board. Once it is safe, we will be commencing in-flight service. On this flight, we will be offering you a complimentary beverage of coffee, tea, sodas, juices, water. If there's anything else that you'd like to make your flight more enjoyable, don't hesitate to call on one of us. Thank you, and have a great flight. Well, this place should be taking about an hour and a half, uh, two hours with landing and everything like that. Uh, it's about an hour and a half to actually get to Toronto where we've got a about four and a half hour layover. Um, and I think I'm probably just going to stop vlogging just for the moment. Wow, there's those G-forces, I ain't going to lie, y'all. Yeah, no, oh, there's some of those G-forces. The plane is turning right now. It's kicking my butt. But I think I'm just going to stop vlogging for the moment. I think I've got my spare phone out, my old phone. I have like 30 hours worth of uh, anime downloaded on it. So I think I'm going to go ahead and start watching some anime. And I'll uh, see y'all. Either if uh, I decide to go take a piss mid-flight, or if, uh, well, or if I decide to go take a piss mid-flight, or when we get to Toronto. So, I'll see y'all then. Have a great one, y'all. vlogging and then the view got really 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 good let me show y'all
It's a beautiful view, I ain't gonna lie.
time for your continued seat to remain seated in seat belts fastened to your cabin baggage stored until we have come to complete the pilot gate and seat belt sign has been turned off. Cell phones may not be used and smoking should only be done in designated smoking areas. When leaving this aircraft, ensure to collect all your personal belongings with you. Should you require any assistance, remain seated and will be better able to assist you once the aisles have been cleared. For those of you with connecting flights out of Toronto, can we check the screens inside the terminal building for information on departing gates and the changes to departing times? On behalf of Entire Canada Express Team, our partner Air Canada members of Starlands, thanks for flying for us today. Have yourself a wonderful stay here in Toronto, wherever you find the destination may end. Bienvenue à Toronto, il repart de Montréal, Toronto, Air Local. Nous vous prions de demeurer ainsi de garder votre ceinture de sécurité bien attachée. Tout vos bagages de cabine branchée jusqu'à ce que le commandant ait une consigne de ceinture de sécurité. L'autorisation de téléphone sera maintenant permise et vous me servez de raison de vous mettre. Au moment où vous pouvez apparaître, assurez-vous d'apporter tous vos effets personnels et soyez prudent en vous vous récompensant supérieur. Si vous avez besoin d'aide, vous demeurez ainsi, nous allons de vous, vous aider lorsque le passage sera arrivé. Pour les passagers qui ayant des correspondances de Toronto ce matin, vous consultez les écrans de l'intérieur des regards ou chercher et de nos plages de passagers. Vous avez toute l'équipe de Canada Express, notre partenaire Canada Monde de Jules Tarius. Merci d'avoir voyagé avec nous et bon séjour ici à Toronto, destination finale. Merci, bon journée à tous. And there we go, y'all. We have now officially landed in Canada, Toronto to be exact. And uh, now I've got about four and a half hours here. Thinking about getting some sushi, watching some TV probably. I think that's the plan. Four and a half hour layover, not too bad. I would sleep, but I don't think I uh, would like leaving my bag while I'm sleeping. So, I don't think I'm gonna do that. Probably just gonna get sushi and watch TV on the on the layover. Four and a half hours ain't too bad though. Probably get some work done too. I think that's the plan, you know what I'm saying? officer from flight tech we're just a few minutes away from entering our gate 164 here uh, please remain seated with your seatbelt fastened until the aircraft comes to a complete stop and the engines have shut down thank you bonjour tout le monde on est juste quelques minutes avant de rentrer à notre barrière ce matin uh, s'il vous plaît restez assis avec uh, votre ceinture bien attachée jusqu'au temps que les moteurs soient éteints merci oui got everything, y'all. Just need to grab my backpack and get out of here. That's the plan. Make sure I got everything in my pockets. I do. And, uh, yeah. I think that's the plan. I'll have to go look at the duty-free shop and see if they have any interesting cigarettes, that's for sure. Not that I'm buying any right now. Because I'm going to Japan where I'm going to be buying lots of cigarettes. But, it would still be pretty cool to see the options they have, I can lie.
do we want to wait until everybody else has gotten off, or do we want to try to get off as fast as possible? What are y'all thinking? Just wait. Like that. One way or the other, we're getting off the plane. y'all we're officially here we're just gonna wait a minute for everybody to kind of get off the plane though and um, we're just gonna wait a minute for everybody to kind of get off the plane though and um, just kind of chill out I think not in any rush to get off the plane because it's got a four-hour layover that's something on my camera lens there we go much better it's very pretty outside though. very cold I'm sure I think they said it was like negative two Celsius, so yeah, pretty cold if I do say so myself. We out of y'all. Thank you very much. Oh, yes, 
Yes, sir. Whoa. What's up? She was not very happy I was recording either. <laughs> she actually she actually told me like, hey, you shouldn't record. And I was like, well, what are you gonna do to stop me? I'm gonna record no matter, I'm gonna record. It's my job. Big bed. Oh, it's so warm in here. It's kind of cold. It was almost like it's below freezing outside. All right, so I assume we don't have to go that way, if I had to guess. Put my chest strap on. Arriving passengers, I guess this way. It's a pretty nice airport, though. This place is sweet. So the real question is, can we get duty-free weed here? <laughs> I don't think so. That'd be funny, though. Are right, we gonna have to go through customs? Yeah, I guess so. This is a nice airport though, y'all. Very cool. Alright, so... Guess we probably want to go the way of connections, right? I suppose. Oh, why, why is everything is in French? We're not. We're not in France. What the hell? I can't believe this. Oh man, there's a lot of planes out there. Seriously, it's almost, it's almost like a Strata. <laughs> Connections we have to do a uh, Yui? I'm confused. Oh, is this connections? No? Oh, connections. I have to go that way. Alright, sweet. Uh is this a D or F? I have no clue. I suppose customer service can tell us. Yeah, that's a good look. I wish we could turn the bathroom over. Start messing around with time. I guess I don't want to get some other chills. This is fair. I've been needing to use, I've been needing to take a piss. Yeah. Okay, so. There we go. Yes, he's as good as any. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, this is confusing, but hey, it is what it is. Thank you so much. Thank 
Oh, so did we miss it? Oh, we must have missed that. I thought that was close. Oh, we yeah, we completely missed that. I thought that was closed. That was really confusing. <laughs> they really shoved this off to the side. So this is, oh, so E, we have to keep going. Oh, we have to keep going this way. So did we come, we came all the way up to one. Oh. Oh. My apologies, I think I might have directed us in the wrong direction. No, honestly, me either. Yeah, it says connections that way. Oh yeah, but E, yeah, E is this, that's so confusing. I just completely missed that scene. <laughs> Dang. Well, all airports are confusing. I guess this one is no different. And yet, still no pisser. Huh? Yeah, no, right? I ain't gonna lie, though. He was really not big on my camera, though. I ain't gonna lie. He was looking at it. <laughs> He didn't say nothing though, so. No, honestly. Ooh, yes sir. All right, let's see. International, still this way, okay. Oh, oh, oh. So we're in Toronto and they have a photo of New York City. <laughs> well, this is essentially just another part of the United States, so. No, honestly. <laughs> Oh, there we go. Thought my zipper was undone for a second. Oh, there's supposed to be like fucking, I don't know, seven or eight of them. I'm sure they're down there. going for international <laughs> and these walkways aren't even going the right way it feels like we're going the wrong way yeah oh there's also bathrooms you're in luck That's such an elegant way of saying it. Ooh, nothing here. Nice. All right, sweet. This is the right place. I'm gonna take a piss beforehand though. Uh-oh. Tried to get you messed up. Niagara Falls? Yo. Now we're going to have to walk all the way to the other side of the airport for the bathroom. <laughs> it do be. Big bad. I'm going to go take a piss. Hell yeah. Man, this lounge is nice, though. I ain't gonna lie, taking that piss was fucking mint. That was so nice. I know I'm gonna have to take a piss on the flight.
I mean, like, you gotta do what you gotta do, right? That's what I be saying. You don't take a shit, the t shit takes you. Hey, yo, is that a Rick and Morty croc pin, bro? No, no, it's not. It's from Naruto. I got it right the second time. I'll take it. I've never actually taken a fucking piss on a bathroom, though, or a shit for that matter, and I know I'm going to have to on the way to Tokyo. So I am... It's going to be an experience. That is for sure. It's definitely going to be an experience. Oh no, they left it at RDU. <laughs> that would actually suck. <laughs> I think in that situation though, they tend to pay for it to get like shipped to wherever you're staying. So they fucking better, you put it that way. It ain't your fault they left it. How was your shit, my man? Hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about, that's what I'm talking about. Oh yeah, we've been getting some snow here, that's for sure. So yeah, we're on AC9. We're supposed to be at least. So AC. Like, no, it's AC9. Right? Because it was like 2000 something for our other one. I don't AC9. Oh, that might be it. Oh, yeah. It could be. Where's that? 13 30, 12 30. Yeah. I think that's one I was leaving. Yeah, Tokyo NRT, that's us. It says port E. Oh, could be it. Yeah, I think on the uh, boarding pass, it said that it's leaving at, like it's actually taking off at 1.30. Yeah. Um, but boarding is at 12.45 because it's a bigger plane. So. I figure I might need my boarding pass and my passport. So I'm going to grab that real quick. Wrong pocket. <laughs> big bet, big bet. How's it going? Yeah. Scan your passport. Touch the screen first and open the down to show you get the receipt. Open your picture Thank you for that. Thank you very much. Oh, okay. Sweet, sweet. That's pretty easy. 
I guess we go down now. I'm gonna down. We'll take the stairs. Oh, duty free shop. Y'all, I might just have to go into the duty free shop and just see what cigarettes they have. I'm very tempted to. I'm gonna go ahead and put my stuff back in my backpack real quick. Yo, they got Burberry here, bro? I'm not that impressed by Burberry, though. That's a bougie brand, I ain't gonna lie. Michael Kors? Whoa. Yes. Yes. It's so cool. It is pretty nice. Oh. Uh, I might be tempted to take you up on that offer. I'm gonna take you up on your offer. Of course. <laughs> Thank you very much, I appreciate it. Was that really loud for y'all too? Cause that's so, it's so echoey, it's crazy. But I couldn't hear like y'all talking outside this hall. That's neat. So cool. Whoa, what's up? <laughs> How's it going? All right, let's see. So. Oh, sweet, that's clean. So we're supposed to be E75? Yeah. Sweet. This is fair. I might go check out the duty free shop in a minute. Go see if they have any interesting cigarettes for sale. Sick. Good, how are you? Wait, where is it? Oh, oh, oh big bet. He's 75. Oh, sweet. Cool, cool. Big bet. So 13.30, so we need to be here like 12.45, I guess. Big bet. Sounds good to me. You just want to walk around and explore? Yeah. Hey, big bet. Oh, can you not? Ah. Custom built burgers. I wonder if they have gluten free. What's the name of the place you're talking about again? Uh, sushi? No, no, no. Horton. Oh, Tim Hortons. Tim Hortons. Yeah. There's got to be one around here. Whoa. I know there's one in term because we're in Terminal 1 right now, I want to say. And there should be one in Terminal 1. I heard that there was. It might be down the other side, though. This place looks good, I ain't gonna lie. Hmm. I'd think they'd have maps about like where the restaurants are and stuff, but maybe not. I don't think it's any further down this way. No. Ooh. Feta panini bar. C 
sandwiches. Wait, what? <laughs> oh, true. Here for four hours and got to get maple syrup, right? Got to do it. Oh, but it's a liquid, though. Is it? Technically. Well, I guess you couldn't take it. You could take it back from here, but you couldn't take it to Japan and then back here because they wouldn't let you back on the flight. Yeah. The Starbucks. You need to tell them how to do their job. Well, there's the other side, because it continues down that way, too. Yeah. I'm going to run through the duty-free store real quick. Here's the duty-free store right here. I'll catch up with y'all. They have a good amount of alcohol. They have Crown Royale. Lots of Crown Royale, actually. Crown Royale Cooler. Actually, that's sick. I actually want that. That's sick. They have cigarettes, though. Cigarettes. I don't see any Crown, I don't see any crown Royale cigarettes. No, just cigarettes in general. It's all alcohol, of course. Hmm. Boxed wine. Oh, here we go. Cigarettes. Found them. Please do not open the cigarettes. All right, cool. When I'm coming back, I might just have to get a pack or two. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. So it's starting device. So how much are $132? $132? This is supposed to be the duty free store. What? That's insane. Palm all smooth. And I've got to buy a full carton. I can't just buy one pack. Oh my God. We got the next select, Palm All Smooth, Palm All Extra, Palm All Full. Players, I do really want to try players. Player Smooth, LDs, John Player Rich. Oh, I am very tempted to buy it, but I've got to buy 200. I've got to buy a whole carton if I'm coming back with this stuff. Okay, I've completed my mission. I've come to the duty free store and found some cigarettes. But they're a lot more expensive than I thought. I'm going to have to figure out what 107 like Canadian is. Because I want to try Canadian Classic Riches specifically. I definitely want to try those. That's these right here. And um, I want to try those. They're 107 bucks for what is that, a carton? So. King size, yeah. It says 25, 825 or 200 cigarettes. Yeah. Hmm. It's a lot of money. It's way more than I'd pay in the States. It's a lot of money. Oh, they got rooftops, bruh. They got rooftops. Uh, this is the knockoff um, Marlboros. Or, no, it's the real Marlboros, actually. Sorry. It's real Marlboros. Interesting. That's cool. Because uh, rooftops in Canada are called, or Marlboros in Canada are called rooftops. That's it. They have cigars here. American Spirit Corsé? I didn't realize they sold American Spirits here. Interesting. Cafe Cream. I guess these are all cigars. They have Dunhills here. I don't know what kind. Of Dunhills king size. It doesn't specify what kind of Dunhills they are. They have Dumar. Heard lots of good things about that. Marlboro Select. Heard not so good things about Canadian Marlboros. Really only rooftops. Uh, but rooftops, also I haven't really heard super pleasant things about either. More Dumar. Export A Medium. Oh man. Man, I want to try them all, bro. I'm not buying any right now. I'm not buying any right now, but I really want to buy, <laughs> I want to buy like one of all of these. Oh man, this is heaven right now, y'all, this is heaven. They've got cigars too, any cigars I know? No, no, I'm not seeing any cigars I know. It's cool they have them though. That's pretty cool stuff. Cool they have them. Okay, so it actually says so for five, that's still kind of expensive, that's not cheap at all. Damn, 478, that's insane. 
That's crazy, y'all. I think definitely if I had to pick one of these I was gonna take back on my return trip to the States with me, it would probably be either the John Players or the, uh, what was it? Or the Rothmans. Rothmans a pretty good one too, I've heard. Or probably, oof. Mm. Having trouble deciding. Probably Belmont's Canadian, probably Canadian Classics Rich or Canadian Classics Original. One of those. But here's just a complete look of all of the cigarettes that they have here, y'all. It's pretty cool stuff. Glad to, glad to see cigarettes at the duty-free shop, that is for sure. Glad to see cigarettes at the duty-free shop. That's some pretty cool stuff. Oh, man. I want to try all of these. <laughs> oh, man. It's such a shame I can't. Oh, well. That's so cool, though. Man. Let's see. My friends are way ahead of me, though. I got to figure out where they are. Where are my friends at? Well, I'm all done looking in the duty-free shop. I've tempted myself too much. I'm not, uh, I'm not buying any right now. I've got plenty of good cigarettes to buy in Japan. And if I had to guess, they, I think they wanted to hit up Tim Hortons, and Tim Hortons is apparently this way. So I'm gonna go this way and see if they're over here. Oh, they are, whoa. What's up, what's up? Y'all get some Tim Hortons? Hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Canadian classic. Oof. Mid-tier. It is very warm in here. I, can, I really am dying. I'm wearing thermals. I got like three layers on top. Man, I'm dying. Damn, man, they had cigarettes here so damn expensive. <laughs> I was like, man, it's a hundred fucking bucks for a carton, bro. I'm like, it's... Yeah, in the duty free store, and it's all got plain packaging. Well, I'm mean, like, granted, 100 bucks, it's like 107 bucks. Like, max, that's actually not that bad for Canada. Like, that's pretty cheap. But compared to like North Carolina, it's like 30 bucks more, I think. But it's also in Canadian dollars, so it's actually only like 70 bucks. So I don't know if I'm doing that conversion right. It might not be as expensive as I think, but they look fucking pricey. Mm -hmm. They have so many fucking cool cigarette brands here, though. John Players, they got Dumar, they got motherfucking Dunhill. Of course, everywhere has Dunhill. They got Marlboros, but Marlboros in Canada aren't actually Marlboros. Rooftops in Marlboros are actually Marlboros. Rooftops in Canada are actually Marlboros. Grandma words all jumbled up. There's levels to it. ATM. Sorry? Essentially, there's lots of alcohol. It's all duty-free, so it's like tax-free and stuff. Um, which is why the cigarettes are so cheap in there, because they don't have to pay, pay the Canadian taxes, because technically they're on international soil, because this is an international airport, I guess. I think that's how it works. I think that's the loophole around it. And the government's not going to stop it. So... I'm going to have to look at the legislation and see if I can pick myself up some for the way back. But I can't buy single packs. I can only buy a carton, which is pretty whack. But for how much they're going for, it might just be worth just getting like a fuck ton. Or not getting like a fuck ton. If I lived here, I'd be getting a fuck ton of them. Let me put it that way, because they're fucking cheap here. I ain't going to lie. I guess it's so warm in here because it's snowing outside and it's like, I think like 30 degrees outside probably. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the park. Park. I'll just sit down for a little bit. Hey, big bad. Sure. Are you trying to get food right now? I could go for food in a little bit. Let me eat a kind bar or something. I do want to take off my jacket, though. I ain't gonna lie. This spot right here? Oh, big bad. That's clean. 
Hell oh, yeah. The green lights are on. Hug your juice. Just the orange peel. Sushi places, that's for sure. I might eat some food in a minute though. I'm, got, I'm kind of kind of hungry. Could go for a time bar. It's 9:28. What did you get? Yes, sir. Chocolate chip. Oh. Oh. So blueberry muffin. <laughs> They sell maple syrup by the gallons here. Oh, no wonder. happens when I'm like leaving like Asheville or Boone or something like that but surprisingly it didn't happen like when with the descent with the plane it's more like my ears are just popping a lot when it's going up but then they kind of equalize going down for some reason I don't know when I was chewing on that snacks for like an hour though the stuff had me buzzed for a little bit there it does I think that might be the sushi place I'm gonna go look at that in a minute it might just be a cart instead of being an actual place or something, I'm not sure. Which would be a little bit whack, but... I didn't see anywhere else for there to be a sushi place here, so... It looked like over there there's a dim sum place and there's a little sushi thing that goes outside of the place. Oh. I think that both of those could be a sushi place. Yeah. I, might go, I might go take a look at this place real quick. No sushi. Thought there was gonna be water there. No sushi. No sushi. <laughs> Just water. Huh? You don't know that right there. Oh, they've got sushi right in front. Of <laughs> I went to the place right there. I completely missed. All right, so now I have now, now I know where they have sushi. I guess. Oh, makes sense. Yeah, they got sushi in the front. Unless that's like sandwiches and stuff. It probably is. Yeah. I'm gonna eat a pine bar though for the moment. That I will. Flossers. My pine bar is probably very melted, but that's okay. Seventy-five. Thought I brought kind bars because all I see is cliff bars here. Cliff bars fucking suck. I hate cliff bars. Like, yes, you can get your electronics from a vending machine. 
Like, no, I'm not putting a thousand dollars into that vending machine and not have, and then having it not spit it out. I probably should, I forgot. <laughs> I think I'm gonna do that in a minute. This kind bar was pretty gas, I ain't gonna lie. I think I'm probably gonna go get some food in a little bit. I think I'm just gonna chill out, do whatever I feel like doing kind of thing. And I'll probably see you guys whenever I'm gonna go get food, in all honesty. And then after that, I'm gonna be getting on the flight to Tokyo, which is like 13 hours. Pretty hyped for it though. Alrighty though, y'all, it's been about an hour, I wanna say, uh, since I eat my Kind Bar. I'm getting hungry, been doing some work. I think I'm gonna go and put away my laptop and uh, go find some food. I was looking, there's a sushi place uh, in the same terminal, but different gate area. So I might go walk over there because I don't think I have to go through security to get to the sushi place. I'm not go getting sushi if I have to go through security, let me put it that way. And um, yeah. I think I'm gonna put my stuff away and uh, go get some sushi. I got my laptop out and everything like that, so I'm just gonna put my mess away. And, uh... I'm struggling right now, y'all ain't gonna lie. Close up my laptop. Forgot to put my USB thing back, but that's okay. I'm just gonna leave that in there. Make sure I ain't crushing nothing. You know what I'm saying? Just gonna put this off, just like that. Let's go ahead and put this. I think that's everything I had out, all put away now. So I think I should be all good. I'm just gonna check real quick. I think that's everything I had. Make sure everything's all zipped up and whatnot. Looks good to me. Got that. I'm just gonna put my jacket over my backpack, I think, because I don't think I'm gonna take it with me, because it is very warm in this airport, which makes sense, because it's like 28 Fahrenheit outside right now, I think. So let's just put my jacket over my backpack. Just like that. Alrighty, though, y'all, I think I'm gonna go find some sushi. Can I entrust y'all in keeping an eye on my backpack? I appreciate it. Thank you very much. I'm gonna go find some sushi, and I will be back. I'm gonna go look at the sushi prices over there first, actually, though, just to get an idea. Go around the corner, there's more. Big bet. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. I will be back. So let's see. Sushi. And... 
Let's see. Sushi, 1899. I think I'm gonna go look at another place and then I think I'm gonna go to the other place as well because I think it's, it is in Canadian dollars, but it does seem, it is in, it is in Canadian dollars, so what, $11.99? I mean, like, I'm seeing some for $11.99. That's really not all that bad, in all honesty. In the States, going to, like, Wegmans or Harris Teeter, it's going to be, like, I don't know, like, $8.99 to $12. So this really isn't that bad, especially for, like, sashimi and stuff like that kind of thing. Not that bad. So I might just go with that, in all honesty. But I also kind of just want to walk around, so I think I'm going to go walk to the place. And, uh, well, it helps with content, too. So, I think I'm going to go and walk to the place and just see what their prices are. And then decide after that. And if I don't like the prices, I'm going to be getting sushi back over here. And I will just have walked around and exercised for a little bit. But certainly no complaints on my behalf. Alrighty, y'all, I'll be back. So E, I need to go that way. Think. Yeah. No. Wait. If I go that way. Oh. Wait. I'm really confused right now. I thought that this was. 83, 84, right? I can go this way, right? No? Oh. So that's down. Right? I'm really confused right now, I ain't gonna lie. I am so confused. Airports confuse the hell out of me. I don't... Am I, is this where I'm supposed to go? I don't think this is where I'm supposed to go. This looks very abandoned. Especially with the escalator go only going up, I really don't think this is where I'm supposed to go. Huh. Okay, well, let's let's take a look. Let's take a look at the map. I thought I could walk to the place, but I don't think I actually can, in all honesty. I don't think I can actually walk to the place. I just got bamboozled right now. It is what it is. Let's take a look. Looking at restaurants. There's no sushi on here, and take a look at the map. Because essentially, if I want to get to the sushi place, I go here, and then I take a right. And I can't do that. Oh no way. No, yeah, it's only for Yeah, I think I, I think I'm messed up. I don't think I can do that. Hmm. I'll just buy sushi here then. That is what it is. I'm not terribly worried about it anyways. But it would have been nice to walk around for a little bit. Oh well, it is what it is. Airports always be confusing me. There's just so much going on. I never know what to do. Ooh. So I thought I could walk through. It turns out you can't just walk through. Huh? To the other terminal or? Yeah, it's what it works to the other gates because the other gates are being used for US flights. So this is the international. So I can't just walk through there, which doesn't make any sense. <laughs> I'm mean, like, it makes sense, but it doesn't make any sense, sadly. Um, but it is what it is. The sushi, I was looking at some of the prices at the one around the corner, and it's not too bad. Um, especially if it's in Canadian, so I think I'm gonna get myself two of those in a minute. Actually, I'm gonna go do that right now. Why wait? I'm hungry. <laughs> yeah, now, I guess it's time for me to get some sushi, y'all. Excuse me, sorry. All right, let's see, is there any sushi here I want? California spicy roll, spicy salmon, combat, 
no. Uh, no, that is the first one. Oh, you have it. Oh, I see. Okay. Just have a rule. Just um, like you have the rules. Oh, yeah. Okay, so like this. Okay. You know what? Let's start with the the first. Let's see how it works. Yeah, I'll get the the street, please. Okay. 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 Getting this sushi though. It looks pretty good. It's eighteen ninety nine Canadian. So what is that? Like probably sixteen bucks USD. It's definitely not the cheapest, but it's actually not too bad for airport food in all honesty. Definitely better than some. I know. Looking forward to my sushi. I had sushi last night. Looking forward to having more sushi. I ain't gonna lie on. It's always good stuff, you know what I'm saying? How's it going? Can't complain personally. I'm just gonna be getting this sushi right here. Any green? Uh, no. I assume water costs. Uh, $3. Nah, nah. $3, dollars Cool. Uh, no, thank you. Oh, thank you very much. Have a great rest of your day. Thank you very much. Whoa. Whoa. It says $18.99, but then it came up to being like 21 bucks. Why did it come up to being 21 bucks? I think I might have gotten gypped. Maybe that's all tax. $18.99 plus tax. Tax must be insane. Damn, that's expensive. Alrighty though, y'all. I'm gonna be giving y'all a full review of uh, sushi I just got gypped on at the airport in Toronto. This is the bento sushi salmon sushi combo. Checked, it's gluten free except for the soy sauce inside, which is not gluten free. I think first off, it might be a good idea if I go get water though. I'll be okay though. I don't need water. Let's go ahead, get all that off. I don't think there was any gluten in this. I hope not, because I already bought it. Yeah. They can take some instruction to get crustaceans and milk. I think milk's all good. Uh, but the only thing that contains wheat in this right here is the soy sauce, from what I can tell. Uh, let's go ahead and just try one of each, I think. Let's go ahead and just try one of each. And that's gonna be the full review. If I can get it open. There we go. All right, now that it's open, it's looking pretty good. I'm just gonna try just one of the plain salmon without the wasabi on it, fake wasabi that is. I'm just gonna try one of these. This is a, a tiny roll, definitely got scammed. It's uh, pretty cold as well. Let's see how it is though. This is just plain salmon. Mm. It's storefront sushi. It's exactly what you'd expect. It's kind of tasteless. Not really much to it. The rice is bland. It's okay, I guess. Let's go and try one of the, I think these are called sashimi. Let's try one of these. Where are y'all heading off to? The duty-free store. Yes, sir. Pick up some cigarettes. That's what I'm saying, that's what I'm saying. This is like the saddest roll of sushi ever. I'm gonna try one of these though. But the sashimi as a whole, 
Oh, this one's sad too. The sashimi as a whole, like it was okay. This, this gas station sushi was exactly what you, well, not really gas station sushi, but like grocery store sushi. It was exactly what you might expect kind of thing. It wasn't really all that good. Bento sushi, it's overpriced. And you can get better sushi somewhere else, uh, but it's not terrible kind of thing. It's not terrible. It definitely is edible, that is for sure. Did you get it here so you can compare it to the sushi in Japan? Oh, just because this is the only thing I can eat. If I could eat, I'm like, they might have gluten-free burgers right there. I have no clue. I didn't look, but but that is a good point. I'm definitely that's definitely why I did that. Yeah, 100. percent The salmon cucumber roll though, that was okay. It was a salmon cucumber roll though. There's a salmon cucumber roll in all honesty. It wasn't really anything new or fresh or anything like that. And then now there's also a salmon cucumber roll that has spicy sauce on it. So let's go and set that down and let's go and try this as well. I will admit that sauce is a little bit more spicy than I was thinking. A little bit more spicy. Mm. Mm. Not terribly so. Not terribly so. Overall, what is my rating for the sushi? Eh, it's average. And that's for grocery store sushi. I've had way better grocery store sushi than this stuff. This stuff, it's not very good. It's gonna get a solid, I don't know. It's edible, five out of 10, just cause it's edible. I wouldn't buy it again though. Although I'm probably gonna buy another one of these for the flight cause I don't know if I can eat the end flight meals in all honesty. Um, but yeah, no, I think that is my final thoughts on the sushi. I'm going to finish it off, though. I'm not going to film myself finishing it off, though, I will admit. I certainly hope you guys have enjoyed watching my little bit of a review of Toronto Airport Sushi. Uh, I think we've got 11.16 right now. Flight starts boarding at 12.45. So we got about an hour, 30 minutes till the flight starts boarding. And... Um, yeah, looking forward to it. 13 hours on the plane then, you try to sleep, all that sort of fun stuff. Getting to Tokyo around 5 p.m., their time. And um, yeah, it's gonna be a fun time overall, that is for sure. But uh, I think I'm just gonna kill the next uh, hour and a half or so that we have until the flight. And then I'll uh, probably start vlogging again once I'm out of board or and everything like that kind of thing. Once. Uh, once, once I go gather around the gate and everything like that, I think I'm going to start vlogging again. But yeah. It's about a board. This is going to take a fat minute though. I ain't going to lie y'all. It really is going to take a fat minute. After a long period of waiting, we're finally... <laughs> no, honestly, they were trying to pull that shit on y'all. After a long period of waiting, we're finally boarding did you, did you the flight to Tokyo. Self-swab yourself? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It just because it says like self-swab and then like Yeah, like mine doesn't say that. It yeah. doesn't say self-swab. Yeah. I did it through the drive through And he was like, yeah, it was really the same like you like, didn't hear from me that it's like uh gold or a pink of the ass. And he was like, and then everything Mm. Yeah. Hopefully, everything is set the right way on the paperwork. It goes through with customs and yeah, it's hot here. Yeah, he says that we get to it. Shouldn't be any problems. It seriously is. Okay. That was a strange. That was so stressful. Unconventional process of getting there. Seriously. I'm just so glad we're all on the same flight. I was afraid we weren't going to be. <laughs> that was going to be a little nerve wracking. Seriously. <laughs> This is yeah. there. <laughs> Hello. Yeah. Uh, it's back. Should be back there. I'm just gonna wait for my friends. It's a 36G. Cool, cool.
is a packed flight though. I ain't gonna lie, it is very busy. Whoa, what's up? I got in on the wrong side. Yeah. Press right here. Excuse me, sorry. So, 36G, 36, 36, 36, okay. So is this 36 or is... 36 what? Or 30 is the row 36, so it's the one that's long here? This is 36. Okay, cool. I just wanted to make sure. But I'm just going that way, so I'm just going to have to have you guys float this way or step to the side, one or the other. Yeah. Perfect. Thank you kindly. Thank you very much. I'm sitting here. That's you, right? That's me. It's so warm in here. I'm gonna take off my jacket in a minute. I'm so ready, y'all. I'm so ready. I'll update y'all once the flight is taken off. So hype. Flight's taking a minute to take off, but that's okay. I'm sitting here for like 15 minutes. I haven't taken off yet. But I mean, like, hey, it's to be expected. It's a plane. I think once the plane takes off, I'm probably gonna take, I was about to say a nap, but I'm actually not really tired enough to take a nap yet. I do definitely want to get some sleep on the plane though. But I'm thinking I'm probably going to watch like an hour worth of TV or something. And then I'm thinking I'm probably going to, yeah, probably take a nap after watching like an hour of TV. And then I'm gonna try to wake up and then get some work done. That's the plan at least. That's the plan at least. I hope, I hope, I, I hope it, I hope it be like that. I hope it be like that, you know what I'm saying? Alrighty y'all, I got my snus. I'm about to take off. And uh, yeah, plane's moving. Excited to take off. It is currently, well, actually I already switched the time of my, on my watch to Japan time. So I actually don't know what time it is right now. I think it's probably, 2.20 or something like that in Toronto. I don't know what the actual time is. Let me look at my other phone see what the actual time is right now. If it wants to come out without taking everything else out of the pocket too. Oh, nope. It wants to take everything else out of the pocket. That is what it is though. Just gonna put that back. Yeah, yeah it's currently 2.20. I predicted correctly. Uh, but, yeah. Nope, finally taken off. It took a little bit. It took a little bit, but we're doing a pretty good kind of thing. Running a little bit behind schedule, but that is what it is kind of thing. That certainly is what it is. Looking forward to getting to Japan and uh, looking forward to the roller coaster G forces on uh, this takeoff. That is for sure, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> there we go. I think we're about ready to go. That's what I'm talking about. Sweet.
go. We are now in the air. That's what I'm talking about. Toronto's a little bit snowy. I'm sitting in the middle, so I'm not next to a window on this flight, but it's definitely a little bit snowy. Just looking out somebody else's window. But, uh, yeah, no complaints by me out there, for sure. to wear your seatbelt towel times during today's flight. Using e-cigarettes, smoking, and consuming your own alcohol or any cannabis products is prohibited. Wi-Fi internet that. service is available on this aircraft. You can connect to the internet by paying with your credit card or Aeroplan points. I ain't doing that. Select the AC Wi-Fi network, launch your browser, and type www.aircanadawifi.com in the address bar. Please note that the use of voice applications is not permitted in flight. Thank you for choosing Air Canada. Enjoy your flight. Yeah, I ain't paying for the Wi-Fi, I ain't gonna lie on it. We're going through the clouds now. Sélectionnez le réseau AC Wi-Fi, lancez votre navigateur et tapez www.cartelandwifi.com dans la bande de l'air. Veuillez noter que les applications vocales ne sont pas permises à bord. Merci d'avoir choisi Air Canada. Bon vol. some TV, probably eat a couple snacks, see if I can take a nap in a little bit, and uh, I think that's going to be the plan. Yes sir, yes sir, you know what I'm saying, I'm saying. Now one thing I forgot to mention, I ended the video and I forgot to mention it, 13 hours. Got 13 hours left of this flight. It's going to be lots of fun. It's going to be lots of fun. So yeah, we're going to be, or sorry, 12 hours and 46 minutes according to my screen that's in front of me. So we're going to be getting there at 1700 1700 is 12, 14, 15, 16, 5, 10. That's actually not too bad. That's actually not too bad. Cannot complain, you know what I'm saying? Cannot complain in the least. It's actually not bad at all. Pretty good timing if I do say so myself. But uh, yeah, looking forward to the next 13 hours. Definitely gonna try to catch a little bit of a nap and uh, just try to watch some TV and get some work done, you know what I'm saying? So this is my first time ever being in an airplane bathroom. I've never taken a piss or a shit in an airplane bathroom before. And um, while well, I'm about to take a piss in this toilet right here. I gotta admit though, bathrooms, it, it's not so bad kind of thing. It's not so bad. It's actually pretty nice. You got a little sink right here. You got some soap. You got a trash can. You got a, you got a toilet. You got something right here. It's pretty nice. It's pretty nice. I ain't gonna lie. We're about, I'm about, I'm trying to think, an hour and a half, two hours into the flight right now, and uh, this is the first piss of the flight. Certainly no complaints on my behalf. I'll have to let you guys know how this experience uh, was after I take a piss, you know what I'm saying?
airplane bathroom. We're about halfway through the flight now. We've got about six hours left. I got you. I got so. Fiction gum in my mouth. Feeling pretty good right now, I ain't gonna lie. A little bit tired. Couldn't really get too much sleep. I'm not gonna sleep in on planes, that's for sure. But, I ain't gonna lie. Looking forward to getting to Japan. Definitely looking forward to getting to Japan. And uh, only six hours left. Only six hours left. So halfway through the flight. And um, yeah, just have to take a piss. That's why I'm hanging out here. I ain't gonna lie. It's a, it's a nice bathroom though. It's a nice bathroom though. Certainly no complaints on my behalf, that is for sure. All right, so there's about, I don't know if y'all can hear me, but there's about an hour and a half of the flight left. I just woke up from a nap, sleeping for like an hour, which definitely was not a nice sleep, but that's the sleep I'm getting on this flight. And um, yeah, looking forward to touching down in the next hour and a half, two hours or so. starting our descent though or we've been descending for the last little bit g-forces are getting the best of me i will admit but i'm doing good you know what i'm saying i'm doing good looking forward to landing though i ain't gonna lie y'all gotta land y'all successfully landed. Cannot complain. I'm gonna put my mask on now. Welcome to Tokyo Narita Airport. The local time is 525. Please remain seated with your seatbelt fastened and your baggage stowed until the seatbelt sign has been turned off. Smoking is not permitted. Mobile receiving and transmitting functions may now be used. Before leaving the aircraft, please check to ensure that you have all of your electronic devices. If you have a connecting flight, please refer to the screens inside the terminal or consult with one of our colleagues on the ground. Thank you for choosing Air Canada, member of Star Alliance for your travels today. We hope you've had a pleasant flight and look forward to seeing you again soon. Bienvenue Si vous devez prendre un vol de correspondance, veuillez consulter les écrans dans la hauteur ou adressez-vous à l'un de nos collègues au sol. Merci d'avoir choisi Air Canada, membre du réseau Star Alliance, pour voyager aujourd'hui. Nous espérons que votre vol a été agréable et souhaitons vous revoir bientôt. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we did run out of the English language customs forms for Japan. Rest assured that those of you that not, did not receive one, will be able to obtain one inside the terminal building. 
We regret this inconvenience and thank you for your patience and understanding. Also, ladies and gentlemen, we would like to remind you that once we get to the gate, only passengers with connections outside of Japan will be allowed to deplane first. In order to facilitate this process, all other passengers are kindly requested to remain seated until a further announcement is made. Thank you. Mesdames et messieurs, pour les passagers qui n'ont pas reçu le formulaire de douane en anglais, nous n'en avons plus malheureusement à bord, mais vous pourrez les trouver à l'intérieur de l'aérogare. Aussi, nous vous rappelons que lorsque nous arrivons à la porte des débarquements, seuls les passagers avec une correspondance aujourd'hui à l'extérieur du Japon pourront descendre en premier. Pour faciliter le processus, nous demandons à tous les autres passagers de bien vouloir demeurer assis jusqu'à ce qu'une autre annonce soit faite pour clarifier la procédure de débarquement. Merci de votre coopération. ま、成田ようこそ。現地時刻は5時29分です。シートベルト着用サインが消えるまでシートベルトを閉めになったまま、お座席にお座りになり、お手、お手荷物も持つままでお持ちください。機内での着用を禁止されています。乗り継ぎ
big brain. I've been driving for a minute. I think this might be a big airport. Probably, yeah. Just me. Yeah. Hey, yo, it's one of the double decker ones. Double decker plane. Our stop up here. Turning circle on this plane now. Better than my Camry's turning circle. That's for sure. Docked up, y'all. It's probably gonna take another minute, but we're almost there. Almost there.
cabin crew please prepare for arrival and cross check. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Oh yeah. So there we go. Now I think we're supposed to sit here for a minute because we're not transferring. So I guess we just sit here for a little bit. I'm doing this too. Either way, it's a bit hectic right now. I think I'll just wait anyway. This one right here? Yeah. It's the... There's a honey Yeah, that's, that's your bag. I remember you putting that in there. Okay. And so would it be this one? Probably might be that one. Appreciate it. And the seat on this one. I got off the plane in a couple minutes. Just gonna wait for the line to chill out just a little bit though, I think. Make sure I get everything, make sure my zippers are closed, everything like that. Make them all good. Like that. Get nothing. Not forgetting anything. Doesn't look like it to me. 
All right, big bear. I think I've got everything I came with. I hope so. I've got my AirPods. That's the most important thing. Everything else is secondary. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Goodbye. Whoa. What's up, what's up? And there we go. It's official. Finally in Japan, y'all. First time ever. Big baller moves here. 1100 bucks well spent. Oh. We're seeing cool cars already. Those are pretty cool. I ain't gonna lie, cool cars are ready. Can't, can't diss it. It's pretty badass looking cars. So what do you think of those cars back there? That's what I'm saying. <laughs> right, let's see, where are we supposed to go? I have no clue. We'll find out, I suppose. Definitely not, no. I guess security is there for a reason. I'm going up the stairs. Got to get some exercise after that flight. Travel. I don't think that's us. But international, oh no, wait, international transfer. Oh, arrivals domestic is us. Yes, it is. Yes. Yes. That's what I'm talking about. Today? Today? No walkways. I feel scammed. <coughs> oh, but they're gonna let the pilot walk on the walkway. Real nice. I see how it is. They turn it up, bruh. They turn it off for the. I feel so scammed, bruh. I can't believe this. No, no, no. I don't care. I want to ride on the moving walkway. We still gotta pick up. No, not your bag. Yeah. No, 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 you yeah, check your bag. Check yeah. yeah we're get the customs and then get check, the bags. get the bags. Yeah. 
this way. That's the plan. I'm gonna be trying to get a sim before I leave because I don't know if they sell sims at every 7-Eleven. I figure they probably sell them at a lot of them, but I don't know that for sure. So I'm gonna try to pick up a sim at 7-Eleven before we head out of here. And before I get on the subway, I might try to find a smoking zone if I can. If not, it's no worries. Bathroom, big bath. This is pretty nice, y'all. This is pretty nice. Just wandering around. I'm not going that way. Priority seat. Nice. I can't remember if I said this in the uh, vlog earlier, but I'm going to be in Japan for five weeks. Two weeks, I'm going to be with friends. Three weeks, I'm going to be solo traveling, which I am a little bit nervous for, but I am very excited for it also. I'm going to be staying in Tokyo, Hakuba Valley, I'm going to be staying in Kyoto, Os uh, Osaka, and then in Tokyo once again. And that's pretty much the lineup. And I might be taking day trips uh, other places as well if I uh, can manage it. Because I'm getting the JRL pass and I'm trying to make my, I'm trying to get my money's worth. That is for damn sure. If you're running. But my JRL pass didn't sign up, didn't, didn't show up one time. <laughs> I, I, I may or may not have not ac accidentally not responded to the email I was supposed to. It was my own fault entirely. So I'm going to buy the JRL pass here, which thankfully is possible right now. Because they're doing a little bit of a, a trial thing or something with selling it domestically for travelers. So we're going to see how that goes. What's up? What's up? What's up? How's it going? How's it going? What's this? This is a little, nice little Zen garden, isn't it? Man, my mask is already killing me. I'm not used to wearing masks. Yeah. How's it going? How's it going? Good. Oh, um, thanks for the Wi-Fi. I pull up the thing. Oh, yeah. Oh, big bet. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah. I took a screenshot. I'm going to grab a phone. But, yeah, I went ahead and signed into the Wi-Fi. It's just a Narita one. There's, like, three of them. First one I did. Yeah, I should probably sign on to that when I have a chance. <laughs> but for the moment, I'm filming. Actually, I'll just go ahead and do that now. Recycling. Went, to, went ahead and took a piss. The bathrooms, I ain't gonna lie, were pretty fucking in. There's some nice bathrooms. What's up, what's up? How was your shit, bruh? Oh, me? Yes, sir. What do you mean? Of course you took a shit. I bet you won't hop this and ride on this. Just kidding, I, I bet you won't actually. <laughs> I'm not doing that. <laughs> I've seen too many people break the glass by doing that. I ain't doing that either. I hope that's going to be okay. Because, yeah. uh, I didn't know much. <laughs> I got my test results with me for a reason. Thank you. 
if you have already engaged with this engineer, but please click the quarantine procedures button to open the screen. If the screen is blue, please bring your health card. If you have not yet registered, our staff will help you in quarantine area. We appreciate your cooperation. This is the announcement for all passengers and those entering the train. You have to go through the quarantine area. If you have already engaged with this engineer, See how this goes. Thank you very much. Where'd you get that card from? The hand is the one I showed them right there. Oh, makes sense. Yeah, I didn't, I, I, I don't know where I would show, I think I have that somewhere. I hope so. Uh, it says no photos, y'all. I'm gonna stop recording. <laughs> Made it through customs. They weren't really a big fan of uh, recording in there, so I, well, didn't. But uh, made it through customs, made it through their quarantine whatever stuff with no issues. And now we're about to take the train to our hotel for the night. So I'm pretty hyped to do. It's like, yeah, it's like 6.30. Oh man, it is 6.30, literally. Yo, they got Starbucks, bro. Hell yeah. Oh, Family Mart. All right, that's where I need to go. I'm gonna see if they have the tourist sims. going to turn off my recording for a minute because I got to see whether I can actually eat this stuff or not. After I was trying to buy my SIM card at Lawson's, 
I just didn't record because it was kind of a mad rush to try to get my IC card and everything. But we're about to get on the train to go to the hotel right now, which is pretty exciting, of course. It's a pretty nice area. Pretty nice. Wait, what? Whew. You know, about to get to the hotel. Do we have any connecting trains or is it just direct? Sweet. So it's just like the DC Metro, but better. Yeah. Sure. I have no idea. Well, big bet, big bet, though. You know, overall, very excited to be here. It's already been a uh, new, fresh experience, that is for sure. I, uh, I got myself a snack, got myself a SIM card. Might or may or may not have gotten myself a pack of smokes at a... Uh, Lawson's, which I may or may not smoke in a video coming soon. Can't spoil what smokes I got, though. But, uh, yeah, I think I'm going to be vlogging until I am actually able to have a smoke at wherever smoking area there is. And then after that, I'm going to end the vlog right there. I'm not ending the vlog until I'm able to have a smoke. That is for sure. That is for sure. Oh, you yeah, guys talking about coin purses? Yeah. Oh yeah, I brought one. I got my uh, Suica card though charged up a little bit and uh now i'm balling i put like 40 bucks on this card i'm balling right now y'all i'm balling right now let that big baller money go on it It's so warm in here. Really? Yeah. Well, I'm also wearing like three layers. And my outer layer is really heavy. That might be why. Just a guess. The rope will raise when the train arrives. Please wait behind the yellow line. No, I don't think I will. So what kind of drinks did y'all get? Georgia latte? Ooh, fancy, fancy. Oh, makes sense. How is it? Pretty good. That's what I'm saying, that's what I'm saying. Hello. That's what I'm talking about. As it should be. Milk tea being warm? This is true. I'm gonna just sit down real quick. Feeling fancy? I'm gonna put my stuff in my backpack real quick. I don't like I'm worried about it. Let's see how these. Let's just roll up. I miss showing y'all the train. Here it is, though. I was putting stuff in my backpack while I was all the trains showed up. I can't believe me. I cannot believe you, y'all. 
Which one do we want to get on? This one right here? Big bat. Wait for all these guys to get off. You're supposed to wait. Oops, sorry. Sorry. Oh, okay. Okay, big bear. Man, they're gonna clean the whole train in two minutes? That's nuts. This is fair, yeah. That's not too bad. Oh, big bear. It's looking like a pretty nice train, though. It's looking like a pretty nice train, though. Can you hold this for a minute? Yeah, big bet. That's <laughs> what I'm talking about, that's what I'm talking about. Hell yeah, thank you very much. Ha had to do it to him, had to do it to him, y'all. Vape niche everywhere. This train is huge. It really is, it's bigger than any train station I've ever been in. Fair. <laughs> Like I've been on like, yeah, like New York don't compare to this. DC don't compare to this. No way. DC is big, doesn't compare to this. Well, it's bigger tall wise, but not long wise. They got, they got free Wi-Fi too, bro. They got free Wi-Fi too. But I like the warm. I needed something warm. Is this because it's sweeter, I think. I should have gotten myself a bottle of water. Oh well. Oh, I don't want to. I don't want to go get a bottle of water and then the train's like, okay, actually, we're leaving you. I know that would be just my luck. I'm not willing to risk it. I can deal with that water for the moment. Do you know what station it drops us off at? Oh, Shinjuku Station Swing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. No. Okay, big bet. Big bet. Hell yeah. But yeah, it's like an hour and 10 minute ride. Sorry? It's like an hour and 10 minute ride. Oh, okay. Hour and 10 minutes, damn. Well, makes sense. It is pretty far after all. Yeah, there's different trains that will take you a more direct route than this is the JR train. Yeah, makes sense. This is going to empty out my entire. 4,000 I put in, probably. I don't think it should, but maybe. We'll find out. Oh wait, because the train's gonna go that way. Right. That makes so much more sense. Okay. That's baller. Okay. But that means we can flip the seats around. Yeah. yeah. That's so cool. That's so cool. Yeah, last time I was on a train, it was somebody somebody decided to take a shit in the middle of the train, and no no joke, I was on the DC Metro, and somebody decided to take a shit, and I was just like. What the hell? Why am I on this train right now? Can you not take a poop in the middle of the train? That's exactly what they did, though. Is this so is cool. DC? This is so cool. Yeah, DC. It's no surprise because it's DC, but... I would say it's no surprise in New York, but DC? I don't know if it's Very equal, in my opinion. People there are both built different.
Oh, it says that this one is reserved seats. Uh -huh. Does that matter? Well, our, our tickets are reserved. I don't know about yours. Well, what did you do? Guess we're gonna find out. Hope it works, all right? Yeah. I don't know if they check stuff here or not. Like, I already went up to the top and paid, or put it in and everything. So. They're all good going, actually. Shouldn't be too long now. Well, it's in bed. Is that it? You need any help with that? Do you want to go and switch the seats around? Oh, wait, we're getting really confused, aren't we? We're going to find out if I'm actually allowed on it. I'm just going to sit next to you and act like I belong. Sick. Like that. You want to sit? Yeah, I got you. Appreciate it. Oh, oh. Yo, cup hold. That's sick. I, think that, I don't think it's an issue. Sweet, sweet. Oh, my water bottle almost died. So there we go, y'all. We're moving. y'all when we get to our uh, destination and I'm gonna see if I can find a place to smoke there because I'm not ending the vlog until I smoke it's not happening I'll see y'all there though
currently 7.56. Been on the train for like 20 minutes now. It's a long train ride, but it's no biggie. And y'all have just discovered something new. How do I do that? How do I recline my seat? Oh, I figured it out. Oh, nice. Sweet. Oh, that's really comfy. I bet I'm hanging out right here in this seat. Yeah, nice. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, no. Turn ride's pretty nice. It's very comfy. Turns out I did something wrong. I had to pay for my pass on the train, but that's okay. It worked out in the end. But, uh, yeah. Don't really have too much else to say. Kind of tired. That was the perfect. Like that, we're getting off of this station, we're getting off of Tokyo Station, and then we gotta do a little bit of a loop. Because uh, we might have made a mistake, but I'm mean, like, hey, it's first time in Japan. It's all about the fun. All about learning experience. Got my backpack though. All good to go. late now. My backpack is coming on. There we go. Backpack on. I'm all ready to go. Tokyo Station? Yeah. Tokyo Station is it's the big one. Make sure I'm not forgetting nothing. Big bet. I got everything I needed. I hope. Whoa. Like that. It's a little bit busy. Thank you for using the station today. Passengers who are carrying larger pieces of luggage, please use the elevator means the people who start on this routine. Thank you. So, wait, what was it? Sobu Rapid Line. Sobu Rapid Line. Sobu Rapid Line. I don't even know. Oh, so we need to go over there. Yeah, platform four. Yeah, we need to go across over there. Yeah, 
Y'all are gonna have to haul your stuff down the stairs. Just throw it down. Yeah, I think this is the same thing. No, that one's going up too. That escalator's going up too. Oh, okay. I guess I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? This way is busy though. This way is very busy. I'm not sure which way goes which way, but I figure this way probably goes this way. I have no clue though. I guess we'll figure it out once it arrives. It's busy though. Not the place we don't like crowds. Yeah, we need to go that way, right? That's busy. We're gonna have fun, y'all. We're getting the true experience today. This is the... Uh, Huh? Pretty sure this is, but it's going in the right direction. Is it? Yeah, because we came in yeah, that way. Know. Where's that? We gotta go out that way. So it's gotta leave us anyway. We might want to go up there and see if we can get a spot because maybe less people would be up there. I don't know. I doubt it, honestly. We're down there. 
Sorry? Okay. Yeah, no matter where you go, it's, it's all the same. It's all the same. It's all the same. Well, I think Colin said one, three, six, seven. Yeah, one, three, four, and six, and seven. Have the fastest exits, so. Okay. You can go up Hopefully the lines aren't long enough. Yeah, it's like Disney World in of itself. Oh, I was completely mistaken. This one goes to Yokohama. Number three goes to Narita. So that one goes to, number, we need to be at number three, not number four. I was wrong. Well, number three is just right there. Wait, what? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, because number, it says number three goes that way. And then that's to Narita Airport, so we need to go back that way. Yeah, it's saying that's the wrong way, but I'm very confused as to why it is. Let's take a look. Well, this one goes to Chiba, too. Number three goes to Chiba, so it goes in the same direction. Yeah. So it's going in the same direction anyway. Yeah, Chiba is definitely where it's Sudanama. Chiba or Chiba? I have no clue. I mean, Chiba is like... Oh yeah, no, it's, it'll flip over. See, it's saying Tsunama, Tsunama. I don't know if I'm saying right there. And then, so that one's going the wrong way. Even though the other one went the right way. That's really confusing. Oh, it's a double-decker, bruh, that's sick. Bruh, it's a double-decker? That's dope!
Yeah, no, not this one. As long as we don't walk through the terminal, we don't get charged. So, so we're going to be getting charged double anyway, because the reservation and then plus this, or at least I am going to be. But, um, Chiba is where we just got like stopped and then kind of turned. So we're heading back to Chiba. That's the direction. Okay, sweet. We'll find out whether we're in a river or not. Mm -hmm. Oh, 
was so confused by the signs that I The map is on right there. The map. The top is in English. Oh, I was just saying the top is in English so we can just see where the stop is. Um, so we need to finish heat. Yeah, I'm able to see the top because it's all in English. Right, but like, can you, it's like, it's actually what it's saying. <laughs> so what's the, the words. what's the top one? What's the stop one to stop at? Kinsicha. Okay, yeah. I see it right there. So, yeah. It's the one with the yellow thing sticking at the top. Okay, so we're going to go to Chiba. So we're at Bakurocho right now. We're at Bakurocho right now, so it's the next stop. Perfect. Okay. Good news. Good news. Oh, so we're under. That's why it doesn't look the same. So we just get off the next stop. Allegedly. Hopefully. Hopefully, right? Those keep keep dream. Yeah. It doesn't cost anything, so if you just stop at the station and then get back on the train, as long as you don't leave the station, it doesn't cost anything. You could go all the way to the most expensive part, I don't know, and then just come back and it wouldn't cost you a single penny. You leave the station, you just get your thing and then turn the same way. Wait, what? Oh, yeah, if you scan, if like, since I scan my, um, my C card, I'm going to be getting double charged. Because I paid for the reservation too. Because it's gonna think I took this train instead. There's nothing I can do about it though. We'll find out. so much more quiet though. Your hoodie on? 
It's cold out. Put my mask back on. Just to keep my face just even a little bit more warm. I'm not not zipping up my jacket. Oh, Spy Family, bro. They got a Spy Family poster. I'm all good. Get prepared for the damn wind. I'm ready, y'all. I'm prepared for this wind. And ain't nothing gonna stop me. I still have not found a place to smoke yet. I have not seen a single smoking area. <laughs> this is I've seen an amusing amount of Carhartt, I will admit. I was not expecting to see this much Carhartt. Oh yeah, definitely a lot of North Face. That's no surprise though. I guess Carhartt is trendy everywhere. This is fair, it definitely is. Damn. Oh yeah, we're good to cross. I'm going. I'm not waiting around. Hey, 
shit is windy. Yo, that shit is nice. Hell yeah, on this side, that shit is nice, bro. I don't, I don't think that's not like a good sunrise. I got a 6, I have 11, 19, I think I'm about to park some cities here. This is where I'm staying for the next two nights. Pretty hype, Park City. Gonna have to go see if I can find a smoking area around here. My hands are dying. I'm definitely wearing gloves next time I go outside. So, we need to get the ticket. This shit is on the floor. Four is, we're on one. What's up? Elevator question? Is there an elevator? I think there's an elevator right there. Let's do that. Nope, step only. Unless. Elevator. Yes, never mind, I'm stupid. Oh, it is, isn't it? Yeah. I still have not found a place to smoke. I need to find a place. I know it's gonna be super windy, I don't care. Alright y'all, I think I'm just going to update y'all when I go have a smoke, because I don't think this portion of the video is going to be very interesting if I had to guess. So I'll see y'all in a little bit once I, once I go come back out into the wind to have a smoke, you know what I'm saying? So we just got to the hotel and I just realized they have an indoor smoking area. I've never actually smoked in a designated smoking area that is indoors before. Of course, it smells like Siggy's in here, that is for sure. Never smoked in an area like this before. Crazy. I've never smoked in an indoor smoking area and I'm honestly so excited too. I'm so hyped, y'all. Never, ever, ever done this before. Never smoked in an indoor smoking area, especially one at a hotel. This would never fly in the United States. This would never fly in the United States. Got my Siggy though. I think I'm gonna go ahead and get one of these, all it up, and go ahead and smoke my first cigarette. In over 24 hours, I smoked my first cigarette ever in Japan. Although I'm not smoking a Japanese cigarette for the first time right now, because that's that's gonna be a future video, you know what I'm saying? Let's go and get this hold up though. Yes sir, yes sir, you know what I'm saying? That's so nice. That's so damn nice. I have really been missing. I really have been missing having a smoke over the last literal 24 hours. It's currently 9.10 Japanese time, and where I live is like 14 hours behind. So it's currently like, I wanna say like 8 a.m. in on the East Coast where I live kind of thing. Uh, yeah, going 24 hours at home without a cigarette, that would've been a challenge. If I'm on a plane, it's a different story kind of thing, but still a challenge. But, I said I was gonna end the vlog when I was able to have a smoke and I was expecting to have to smoke outside in that wind. I'm really glad that I, I'm gonna make sure my video is actually recording. Okay, thankfully it is. Um, but I'm really glad that I don't have to smoke a cigarette outside in the wind. That wind was insane, I ain't gonna lie y'all. So I'm very glad I don't have to do that. Um, I'm glad I get to enjoy my cigarette inside and I'm gonna be enjoying my cigarettes inside for the next couple days. Although I don't think I'm gonna be doing reviews in here, not only because I'm sure it's very echoey on video, it's very echoey in real life too, uh, but also because other people are going to be walking in and out of here. 
and uh, I'm a little bit too awkward to do reviews in a closed space like this. First time in Japan, first time smoking a cigarette in Japan, first time smoking a cigarette in an indoor smoking area. There's a lot of firsts in this video. First time taking the, the Tokyo Metro, man, first buzz in 24 hours. There's a lot, there's a lot, well not first buzz in 24 hours, I did first cigarette buzz in 24 hours. That's the way to put it. But man, I ain't gonna lie y'all. Man, I'm feeling, I'm feeling so good right now. This is getting me, this Hesky right here is getting me so buzzed, I ain't gonna lie. Man. Man, wow. These are heavy. I forgot how heavy these are, especially after 24 hours. I'm chilling right now. It's a really nice smoking room though. Man. I'm so glad I don't have to smoke outside right now. It's so cold and windy. It's insane. I'm so glad I don't have to smoke outside right now. Oof. Man. But I certainly hope you guys have enjoyed watching this vlog. Uh, I don't do many vlogs like this. It definitely takes it out of me, that is for sure. Uh, I have been very tired all day, not only because of the lack of sleep, um, and uh, I, I hope you guys have enjoyed. I hope you guys have enjoyed this little bit of a different video. I uh, wanted to vlog me going to Mexico, um, but I didn't, I didn't end up doing that. And uh, I'm very glad to have uh, vlogged myself coming to Japan for the first time. It's been lots of fun vlogging. I don't do many videos like this, and uh, maybe I'll have to do some more like this here. No guarantees on that, but it's um, been a lot of fun nonetheless, you know what I'm saying? I think I got like three and a half video, three and a half hours with the video. Um, lots of video, that is for sure. Lots of video. Man, I'm so buzzed right now, though, y'all. I'm so buzzed right now, man. Certainly no complaints about the app. Man, genuinely no complaints about the app. This is so nice right now. I certainly hope you guys have enjoyed watching this video though. Oh man, I'm buzzed right now. I don't like wasting cigarettes. I know I still have part of that cigarette left and um, I don't like wasting smokes, but uh, I did waste a little bit of a smoke today. That is what it is though. I'm so buzzed right now. I'm feeling good. First smoke in 24 hours, feeling good. Oh, thank you very much. Um, got, my, got my hotel card. Thank you for waiting for me. I do appreciate it. We are eleven oh two. Do y'all wanna do y'all all wanna get in the shot? What do you say? Do y'all wanna get in the shot? I'm doing the outro. Oh no, you're good. Um, <laughs> I wanna be in it. You wanna be in it? Alright. Thank you very much for uh watching today guys. I certainly hope you guys have enjoyed watching. <laughs> Is it only good though? Um, oh. Um, Oh. oh yeah, that makes sense. Where's the swipe? It's on the like down here in the bottom. You just oh, it. there isn't one on this one. Oh, I don't see it. That makes sense. Oh. Big bad. <laughs> Whoopsies. Oh, sorry. Mm, I'm
这来对吧？主管有讲。有人来，那无讲信用。Big bet. This is us, right? Big bet. Thank you. Big bet. See y'all soon. So we're in eleven o two. Big bet. All the way at the end. Well, I certainly hope you guys have enjoyed watching this video. If you guys have enjoyed watching this video, of course, make sure to like and subscribe for more content. I have my Instagram. Oh, you got it. Big bet. Let's see. I can't let y'all see too much of it because I might be giving y'all a tour of this, uh, of this hotel as a video. But, let's see, where's the light switch? What? Wow. Trying to find it. Wow. What a view. Where is the light switch? I have no fucking clue. <gasps> Where's the light switch? Door, right? There you go. This guy? Oh, I clicked these. Yeah, it oh. doesn't work. This guy? We didn't pay for power. <laughs> That's what we did. Water works. Water works. It's all good. <laughs> oh, let's just get one of these on then. Huh. Uh, yeah, power don't work. No, no, say. Put my bag down. There's not even like an inkling of a switch. That's all controls for the bath and toilet. <laughs> this is the shower. Wow, that's such a cute color. There's no power. There's, no, there's like clearly lights. It's gotta be this guy. These have to be the lights, but they're not working. We have to turn something on? Corby. Cancel. I think this is the heater. Oh, there. Oh, do we have to? Oh, oh. the key card goes in there, and that's what activates the power. Oh, oh okay. Out. Oh, so you just have to put... Okay, oh, okay. that makes sense. That's very confusing. Sure. That's cool. That's very confusing. This oh view! God. This view is beautiful, though. I'm just sitting down. I'm, just... I'm going to do my outro right here. <laughs> oh, I guess you got to leave the card in. I'll go put my card in. I keep trying to do the outro, and it keeps getting interrupted. There we go. Big bet. Oof. Well, though, I certainly hope you guys have enjoyed watching this video where I went to Japan for the first time and I took the most inexpensive flight possible, which was still $1,100. I smoked a cigarette in Japan for the first time. I got my first buzz in 24 hours. And I also smoked a cigarette inside a place where I'm actually allowed to smoke a cigarette for the first time as well. Like, or like in a designated smoking room inside an area. I've never done that before. That's not a thing in the United States. But um, I certainly hope you guys have enjoyed watching this video. If you guys have enjoyed watching this video, of course, please make sure to like and subscribe for more content. I have my Instagram, my book, my merch, my P.O. Box, and my second channel all in the description down below. Go check it all out. But yeah, thank you very much for watching, y'all. To the next one, stay safe and peace. Have a great one.